Jonathan Jonono Moyo is back to work full time as President Emerson Dambuzo Munangagwa's violence advisor. Why do I say so? If you look on Jonathan Moyo's tweet, he says a secret or a structureless organization or a political party which claims to be the government in waiting would be a serious concern to any authorities anywhere in the world. And more often than not, being structureless is tantamount to being lawless, which breeds criminality. And the question is, why is Jonathan Moyo so concerned about Citizens Coalition for Change? We have so many political parties which are structureless. We have so many political parties which you don't even know who is the president, who is the vice president, or who is who. You just know maybe the president alone in that political organization, that political entity. Go to Madukus NCA. Can you tell us the structures of Love More Madukus party? Can you tell us uh, the provincial leadership? of Love, Love Moma Duku's political party. Love Moma Duku is uh, uh, one of the legal minds in the nation of Zimbabwe, but his political party does not have structures. But each and every day, Jonathan Moyo wakes up to criticize Citizens Coalition for Change. Why? It's because Jonathan Moyo is aware that the coming of Nelson Chamisa as the president of the Republic of Zimbabwe is going to open can of worms and Jonathan Moyo will not be spared because he was part of the uh, brutal regime which was so corrupt which looted billions of dollars uh, from uh, the state coffers which impoverished a lot of Zimbabweans, millions of Zimbabweans. That is the reason why they are all running scared. It's not about change uh, or Jonathan Moyo, no. It's not about uh, anything else. It's about defending what they looted. It's not about uh, incompetence of Nelson Jamisa or lack of structures. No, it's about fear to lose everything, fear to be imprisoned, fear to be uh, brought back to Zimbabwe to face justice because they looted millions and billions. And these were um, millionaires overnight. They never worked anywhere, but they are millionaires. So. I don't know, guys, what you think about this, but I've given you my thoughts and my views. Register to vote and make sure that you vote for Nelson Chamisa.